Hi everyone, I've just come to share with you a design team project for Ephemera's Vintage Garden. The kit that I've used um, for this um, journal um, is called Merry Melody and the link will be below to the kit. Um, there is also a 50% off until uh, December 31st so quickly get over there now and grab yourself a deal. Um, I've also used throughout some freebies for my Ephemera's Vintage Garden so if you've not already signed up and subscribed to um, Debbie's, Debbie Ann's blog I'll put a link, well the link, the link for the kit um, will be below and the link to the blog will be below as well and it kind of explains um, for you to sign up and you will um, you will be able to get the free um, digital prints that Debbie very kindly gives away. So I've used this one as well which is called A Vintage Christmas. There's none left of it. Um, so I've just kept the bottom so that you know. Vintage Christmas postcards. Um, there is some uh, Christmas gift tags in there as well. There is some Merry Little Ones and there is some Christmas children in here as well. I haven't used everything in here but that's just what I had left from previous projects that I've used. The kit measures seven inches by five and a half and it's wire bound and I haven't done a wire bound in absolutely ages. Um, the rings is the binder all I use and this is uh, one and a quarter inch rings. Um, it's turning out really chunky and obviously I want to use this for um, for this Christmas, the December and um, all my Christmas photographs and whatnot. I'm not a daily um, journal or anything so this will just probably at the end of, towards the end of the month I will print out all my pictures and um, add them all inside. Um, I'm just trying to think if there's anything else. Oh, the other paper that I used alongside of it is... Um, Tis the Season by uh, Dovecraft Collections and I've had this couple of years and I'm really down to the last scrap pieces of this and I also used some of this which is Jingle All The Way and it's by First Edition Paper um, and you'll see I think that's all the paper that I you know the other paper that I used and the rest is just um, bags and envelopes and whatnot so anyway this is the front cover um, I've left it pretty flat because I store all mine on a uh, in a bookcase and I can't have anything too kind of bulky otherwise it will just kind of get ripped off I'm not sure if you can see but I have glossy accented um, the little girl here I'm not sure if the lights picking that up I just stamped out the word December and put that on there and this little sticker here says celebrate and I celebrate and I added that um, and I thought I had some number stickers and I can't find them anywhere because I was going to put down there 2015. So let's do a flip through. So in the, on the front cover um, I've used an envelope, added a doily and this is a piece from the kit. And I've, I've got some handmade tags in there as well so I've just put them in there like so. Here I've got a corner um, tuck just by using a doily and a poinsettia to decorate it um, and this is one of the freebies and I love these birds they're absolutely gorgeous and one of my tags so I can journal one here if I wish and I can slot a photograph in there I've left that plain because I may just paper clip some um, some memorabilia and photographs in there I've made a um, an envelope using some of the paper from one of them collections and on here I've just used um, this image here from Ephemera's Vintage Garden and it's plain on the back to add a photograph. Here we've got a large um, doily tuck um, and this was one of the freebies and I've just used some uh, glittered ribbon here and this is one of the, um, I think this is one of the freebies as well. I've just made some tucks here and I've used um, this image uh, which is really sweet. I love all the vintage colours. Um, here I've just, this is one of the freebies and I've just backed them all onto some cream cardstock and you can see that lovely 
um, lovely digital image there. Here again I will just paper clip maybe some photographs in there. Uh, this is just um, like a smaller page and this is a envelope pocket thing here. I'm just trying to put this in. One hand it's not working. Um, there we go and it also, I can also put things in there so it's like that. I've just added some paper clips with some ribbon throughout as well. <clears throat> here I've just um, added one of the images here back on some cream cardstock and just pop that on there. Here we've got a large um, pocket which I've made from an envelope and this is from the kit. Um, I've made a pocket there so you can actually put things inside the pocket and tuck behind. Um, I've added the paper clip here so that I can add my photos onto there when I print them all out and do a little bit journaling. Another envelope pocket here and it's got a doily on there. Uh, here I've done um, like a double tuck so that's left so you can tuck things in there as well. And this lovely image. This page um, I've left it opened at the side as a tuck and I just downsized some of the paper and just made them into little tags. So that goes in there like so. Um, I've got some paper bag pockets here um, so I can put quite a bit inside there as well. Just decorated that with some paper, a doily and a poinsettia. And this is from the kit. <clears throat> I may not use all of my handmade tags um, but it's nice to have them. Here's a, a journaling spot here and here we've got one of the envelopes. Not an envelope, a pocket. Um, so I can put things inside there. I'm not sure. No, I glued that down completely. Um, so that's that. Here I've just made a little corner tuck at the top. So I can slot a photograph up inside there. Um, here I've just used some ribbon to make a, a side belly band. And just used this little cut out from the, one of the freebies. Um, and I've glued it that side to... Um, stop anything falling out that way. Um, that's another one of them little tags that I've cut down. Uh, I've stuck this piece onto one of um, the scrap pieces of envelope that I made these large pockets with, wherever they are now. Um, so I've made that so I can put a tag inside there. Here we've got some of the freebies again with some gold glitter ribbon. And some more tags. <clears throat> and here I've just done a um, tuck with one of the um, journal pieces. And that's left so that I can just slot some photographs in. Because I think I'm going to go mad this year and take lots of photographs and actually print them out. <laughs> um, here another envelope with this beautiful image on there. And I could actually back that again another journaling spot. Didn't think of it at the time. Somewhere to put a photograph. Um, <clears throat> this is just a little journaling card. Here I've made a pocket with one of the ephemera pieces and these are one of the little kind of library cards. Um, a top tuck here for a photograph. Here I've just done a doily and a banner. Um, and here I've just added my paper clip ready for my photographs. Um, here we've got some of the tags. This was the freebie and this was just a stamped one. And here again I can just paper clip. Um, and this is another paper bag so there's lots of room inside to tuck things in. Just got a banner tuck here. Here I've just made um, another one of these pockets and tucks, so that just tucks in behind there. Here I've got um, another envelope which is, I've used as a large pocket and a tag inside there. And that's another one of these lovely images which was um, a freebie. So that tucks in there and also space in behind. This is going to be a right chunky journal when I've finished with it. 
um, just a pocket here with a handmade tag. Here I fussy cut the um, the, the bird out and I backed it onto some cardstock to strengthen it up a little bit more because I'm using that as a, a tuck and a tuck space here to, to put some photographs and here and on the back page this was a freebie just another envelope with a handmade tag um, so that is my design team Christmas personal journal um, because last year I I made I make quite a few but I only ever use one <laughs> um, so I'm looking forward to filling this up <clears throat> Uh, this year. Oh, that's the back. It's just plain. Um, I may add some ribbons. I'll uh, make a, a Christmas bead dangle. I haven't got all my um, jewellery stuff, uh, bead making stuff I should say. Um, so like I said, the link will be below to the kit. Uh, don't forget this 50% off. Go grab yourself a bargain and a link to the blog as well. Um, if you have any questions, just ask and thanks for watching. Bye.